another new tool that you guys came out with. These products are in Granger, and that is the Lockwood hook. Uh, tell us the story about that. That's a, another interesting story as well. Yeah, one of the things that we do, and I got a hook here, but one of the things that we continue to do is we have on uh, staff uh, by, by retainer four national trainers. So they're always training new firefighters. They're always thinking, you know, I think, I think a lot of firefighters are frustrated uh, inventors. So every year we'll get maybe 10 or 15 guys, you know, who has the next best thing, you know, the next, the best uh, mousetrap. And uh, a lot of them aren't thought through very well, but the Lockwood hook, a guy named John Lockwood came up with this hook. Why don't you put the cell sheet on, uh, uh, be easier. This is six foot. So, so if you look, if you look at the nose of the Lockwood hook, um, this tool replaces the um, pike pole. Um, originally, the New York hooks, which are oil and granger, were replacing the pike poles. Uh, they're just more versatile and more durable. Um, and the one bad part about the New York hook was that when you sound a roof, in other words, if there's a fire under the roof, they take this nose of the tool right here in the square, in the cutout square, and they hit the roof with that to find out if there's a, if it, it, if it will give away. Um, so the longer nose helps you sound the tool, sound the roof more easily than a New York hook, hook will. Uh, Back to these tools are really taken over quite a bit of the market share of the pike pole. Used to be there was only pike poles. So now um, these two tools combined are taking about 25% of the market share of what used to be only pike poles. Wow. Uh, so the other uh, advantage of the Lockwood hook is the Halligan bar also fits in that little mouth there. If you can see right there, the halogen fits right there so that the halogen can go in. There you go. It fits right in there and then it's strapped in because a lot of guys will take the Lockwood hook and the halogen in as their fire ground tools rather than an axe. Um, so it was important that 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 we came up with that, that they came up with that design because on the New York hook, you cannot put the halogen in there. And it's cumbersome to try and put put two tools together, uh, and and this has been uh, widely uh, uh, trumpeted as the next best uh, fire hook, if you will. Yeah, I remember when you guys uh, first came out with it, when you called me up about it and sent me this sample here. Um, you know, it's it's definitely a very unique tool. You got a lot of sharp angles here uh, for prying or uh, trying to tune, uh, you know, and, and uh, listen to the roof and all that. Love the feature of uh, being able to uh, merge in the uh, Halligan bar with it as well. Uh, again, making it easier to carry.